Do you always lack money? Do you always find it difficult to receive favor from people? Are you the type that you are into business or whenever you make money, before another money will come or before another money will come into your hands, you might have finished that first one or maybe you will sell your goods today, you will not sell again until that particular one you sold, you spent it finished. Or are you the type that whenever the money comes to your hand, unnecessary expenses, unnecessary issue will just occur just for you to spend that money without achieving anything tangible with the money. Are you the type that your hands always scratching you? 24 hours every day, every month, every week, your hands is scratching you and yet no gift of money coming to your hand. Yet you go to that your business and still not make sales. Yes, people will promise you and they will never fulfill it. Now, watch this video that I'm about to share with you to the end. Believe you me, after doing this, you will come back and tell me, promise, thank you for this. So stay tuned while I share with you. But before then, you welcome back to my channel, my page. Wherever you see this video, you're welcome. Here I share more tips on how to help your life in daily basis using the natural things that God created. So if you find it helpful and you want to learn more, please do subscribe or follow me. Alright? God bless you for joining today. And if you are a returning subscriber, I really appreciate you and I pray that my God will bless you. Alright, and grant every of your good desires. So guys, in today's video, this particular recipe, you can call it money drawing method. You can call it a, like God's blessings because let me tell you the truth. After doing this, money shall never lack in your hands. You shall not find it difficult to make money. Alright, so just do it. But don't forget to apply faith whenever you are doing all these things. And also pray. Because prayer is what makes it to work more effectively and very fast for you. Okay? Now, this is what you need to do. Alright? Now, you need to go and get cinnamon powder. Cinnamon powder. If you don't know what cinnamon is, like so many persons will be asking what is cinnamon. Please, you can Google it. Google will give you a clear picture of any item that I mentioned here. So, get yourself a cinnamon powder. When you get a cinnamon powder, okay, just get yourself a white sugar, like white powdered sugar. Now, get salt. You can use any of the salt, okay? Now, when you get these three items, or if you have it in your home, just pick it in your home. In the morning before you step out or before you start your daily activities for the day, you want that day to bless you. You want your hand never go wrong. You want your hand never dry. You want the God of the universe, you want the almighty creator of the heaven and earth to bless you with abundance of the day. So you are using this method as a point of contact, talking to God that he should bring money to you. As you go to that business, that customers will start coming. That sales that has, you have been experiencing, that you have, that you have been having difficulties that God should restore it back to you those that are forgotten you that God should touch their heart to remember you now when you do what you do is this first of all when you get these items hold it in your left hand mix three of them and hold it in your left hand like this okay when you hold it in your left hand like this now get your Bible and read Psalm you are going to read number one Psalm 62 okay and again, you read Psalm 23. When you read this Psalm, you will definitely understand why I said you should read it. Now, after reading these two verses of Psalm, begin to pray. Call money and say from today, money shall never dry in my hands. I shall not lack money. Money will come to me in my business. You begin to speak into existence. You begin to speak into the heaven, into the earth. That blessing, you begin to call money to look at you. This recipe works like magic. Don't joke with it. Yes, you might not receive millions. You might not receive billions. But let me tell you, this your bare heart shall never lack money when you are doing all these things. These things are very natural. These things are natural and they are all edible. They have their own spiritual benefits to help us as a human. Alright? So you just pray and say, from today, my hands shall not lack money. Whatever that are eating the works of my hands, you that your hand is scratching you 24 hours without nothing coming in, is not good. It's not good. That shows that spiritually something is eating the works of your hands. It can be anything. 
It can be manipulations. It can be foundation. It can be projection. It can be that somebody is sharing your God-given glory. So for whatever that it is, tell God that you are using this method, that anything that is eating the works of your hands, anything that is making you to labor in them without achieving anything, anything that is making that when money comes into your hand, before you know it, the money will just go. There is some person that when they receive money, all of a sudden somebody will fall sick and they will spend that money on that. Or all of a sudden something, one issue or the other will just occur just for that money to go for that purpose. And by so doing, you won't be able to use that money to do a tangible thing. You won't be able to use that money to invest in your future. So you are talking to God that whatever that it is under this earth, under this life, that are eating the works of your hands, that are making your hands to dry, that God by his infinite mercy, that he should use this method to deliver you and let all those things you receive like that from today this your hands shall not lack money that this your hands will count money this your hands will count the amount that you have not counted before yes it's possible all right then after you're done making your prayers why i'm just explaining like this so that you will understand what to pray for so you understand the area that you table your prayer so this is all about abundance this is all about money this is all about wealth this is all about god's blessings Okay, so after you're done making your prayers according to your desire, now begin to rub these items in your hands as you're making the same declaration. Now, as you're rubbing it, you're going to be feeling the hot sensation. Don't worry, begin to, whatever that is in my hands that is eating my efforts, whatever that is in my hands that is making me not to... To, to make it in life, or whatever that is making me that whatever I started, I will not finish it in a good way. That today, God, by this option in my hands, let those things receive greatness. Let those things receive favor from God. Then after you're done making that, thing, now go and get a water. You can get it inside the bowl or you can go to your tap anywhere. Just on the water. As you on the water, you begin to watch your hands with the water. You keep making the declarations. You keep making the declaration. Today, as you watch your hands, you are washing out this lack. You are washing out this thing that is eating your effort. You are washing out this thing that is eating the fruit of your hands. You are washing out this thing that is making any business that you do will not succeed. This thing that are making you, that money comes and that money will just go like that. You are washing it out of that from today. Your hands shall not lack money. So you begin to bless yourself as you are washing these hands. Then after that, please don't don't towel your hands. Allow that same water to dry in your body. Alright? Then after the water dries, then you can move on and do every other thing that you want to do for today. Just do this with faith and I wait your testimony. Definitely you will come back and thank God after. You can choose to be doing this every day. It's fine. You can choose to do it once in a while, but don't abuse it. The reason why that some spiritual work works out, methods are not working for some people is because over abusing it. So you can choose to be doing it maybe first day in a week or three day, uh, three times in a week and all that. But you are going to see a lot of change, positive change in your life. Please don't forget to come back and share your testimony after this. And above all, share this video. Like it, subscribe and follow me if you have not done that. There is a whole lot that you will benefit from this space. Thank you for watching. I love you and stay blessed. See you in my next one. Bye.